Hi everyone, Yvette here. I have a junk journal for you and this is a wedding planner that I made for my soon-to-be daughter-in-law and um, I gave her this um, before Christmas last year and um, so she started filling it out. So I used an old cereal box and the journal itself measures just over three inches by seven and just over seven and a half by ten and a half. And I used a hitch fastener for the closure with a ponytail holder. And this is the back. It has seven signatures. And there's the back with the closure and the eyelet. And it just has lots of yumminess. And um, I really like the way it turned out. So, I will go right into it because um, I tried to tape this already once and it was too long, so I'll try it again. So, on the cover here, I have a magnetic, uh, magnetic pocket and she's already started to use this, so she's got business cards and receipts and notes in there already. And here, this is a music sheet, and this is um, just something she wrote there. And I love the name of this, so we just left it as it is. The race is on. So, and here she's got sticky notes of stuff already. This is the day that my son proposed to her, so she wrote down how it happened. This is a just an image from um, a. a, a a bridal magazine that I put there just to show her how she can use some of it. So, and here she says she's going to put the engagement photo. So she's got a sticky note on there. And then here she has a photo of a cow. And my son's a farmer, so he proposed by writing "Will you marry me?" on a cow that he likes. And uh, he spray painted it with some paint and that's how he proposed to her. So she's going to put a picture of that there. And here she's got pamphlets and business cards, an altered paper clip. She's got notes here, um, the wedding planner, planning timeline. So here she's got 12 to 10 months of what she needs to do when she checks it off. Uh, eight to, 10 to 8 months, 8 to 6 months. And I made these little tabs with these little golden, gold little um, stickers that I found at Michael's, I think. Or it could have been a scrapbooking store, actually. It could have been a scrapbooking store. And here she's got six to f uh, four months, three to four months, the week of the wedding, the month prior. It's just lots of notes anyways. I distress the pages with walnut stain. Line photos. And here she's got her return address stamps or stickers, receipts. This is save the date. It was a magnetic for the fridge. Um, these are stuff, things we put in the wedding invitation when we sent them out. This is a cutout from the magazine again and it was on invitations. So the next section she put some invitation information. These I just cut out from the magazine again just to put there. This image was from a magazine too. And this is a chunk of lace that we liked for the, the invitation, so she just left that in there. We have some graph paper, this is an envelope, and actually this is the wedding invitation that we did end up making. And um, we did this together, so this has a little pocket, the directions, the accommodations, the RSVPs, and the reception information. And then we have the... Um, little doily with the emboss um, letters of their first names and then the invitation up here is the wedding information so anyways it turned out really cute and then we have an envelope here graph or le general ledgers and then we have journaling cards paper clip papers all been coffee stained um, here she's got the bridesmaids and the groomsmen's and these uh, square lace daily doilies I got from Denise at a tattered dream and her YouTube channel is practice makes pretty 
and she has beautiful things in her shop, her Etsy shop, so I will link that below, and uh, or I'll link her YouTube, and then she's got a link in her Etsy shop down there, so uh, check her out, she's got lots of wonderful things, I bought a few things from her, more journaling cards, and I like the way how this is all layered, and in the center of my signature, I have a pocket, a belly band here, and this is just things that I put in there so she could, you know, wedding pic wedding dress pictures and just so she could see how to use it. Got a doily and then a chipboard piece. Here's a tip in. Another, more pictures of wedding dresses and this is a little coin envelope that I also got from Denise. And then she's got business cards in there. Some ephemera. This is a, um, garment tag or it's a tag from Denise's Etsy shop too so check her out there and some rub-ons more pictures and here's a color scheme for her wedding she's got another little tuck spot we got some ephemera pieces there journaling card that she's already written on ideas for bridesmaid dresses more notes of where she's gonna put some of these photos uh, jeweler and then here's just extra paper to journal along uh, tuxedos I love how this turned out and then these are the people that are going to decorate her hall more um, paper with lines and here she just glued in her seating plan This is a paper bag envelope with some tags and notes, and I've got a timekeeper card in there too. More music notes, and I love how this turned out also. These are the caterers, a doily, more pattern paper, wedding cake and ideas. So here she's got some ideas on her wedding cake, and then more information, another coin envelope. These I bought um, clearing out at Michael's, so they're nice little tags. Paper bag, more general ledgers, decorating ideas, more graph paper, some journaling cards here, another center pocket page, more ledger papers and graph papers, coffee stain papers, a recipe card. And here I made just a small envelope with the envelope punch board. And more business cards, doilies. And then this is an idea of cards that they're going to um, have for uh, favors, wedding favors. And then um, this is a center envelope. More journaling spots and more three by fours journaling cards. Ledger paper. This is a glassine bag. Another journaling card there. I like how that turned out. More journaling cards. I think this is a Prima one. Another coin envelope, altered paper clip. More journaling down here. Another tip in more papers. There's lots of room in here so she's probably not going to use it all. Library card, this is also from Denise and this is a journaling page. There's a nice quote down here. And here she's got emails and photography information. Emails. Another envelope. Another tuck spot here, and an envelope here with another few cards in there. More wedding information here, little pocket in the bottom. Another doily, another library card. Another envelope here, one journaling cards. Another 
Others pocket here. More information, the place, the time, and the date. Another envelope, more music sheets. Another tip in. And then here we have a nice. I forgot to glue this in. But there's a nice ephemera, another garment tag. More papers, another little envelope. So she's got lots and lots of room to write. And uh, she said she probably will be able to write a few years in here. So she probably will write information on, I just love how this little paper clip turned out. So she'll use it for um, probably uh, honeymoon stuff and first year anniversary. Because there's lots of room. Another pocket here, that's the center of my signature, another tag. More journaling cards here. Another doily, and then the back of the end of the book. And this is the pocket. And that is my junk journal for my soon-to-be daughter-in-law. And she is using it for her wedding planner. Hope you like it, and until next time, talk to you later. Bye.